Hey guys, it's Jonathan from Bullet Motorsports. Today I'm going to show you our 1964 Dodge Polera. It's a really unique car, super straight body lines, uh, black on black interior. And what's really nice about it, it's a southern car, so it means it has really solid body panels. The underside's super nice, and it is fairly original underneath. Uh, the heart of this car is a 440 with dual quads, and it has dual regulators, so when you are uh, playing around with your friends in the garage, you can actually adjust the fuel and tune it to, to your preference, and that's what those gauges there are for. Uh, it doesn't have power steering. It does not have power brakes, but it does have a dual master cylinder. This car was in a museum, so what we did is we replaced all the cylinders on all four of the wheels, did a uh, bleeding procedure on the brakes, and we were able to get a nice firm feel, and we were able to take it for a nice 15-mile drive. Um, I'm going to walk around the car right now, and we're going to put a magnet on it, and so it's your typical magnet that you get at the store or when you buy something from Rock Auto, so it's not very powerful. see right here so it's there's some filler here check this door no problem solid and then to the sand right here so overall it's a really solid car all the body lines are really straight I'm gonna open up the door right now so you can see the interior uh, original interior, Hurst 4 speed, all the gauges are intact. They did add a oil pressure gauge so you can monitor your pressure in your engine. Car runs and drives great, has a lot of power and is very throaty. So at the end of this video we'll have a nice idle for you to be able to see and feel how it sounds. All of the bright work and chrome is in excellent condition. It's not show quality but it does not have any pitting and it shines super well. Uh, it's very humid out here, so anytime we touch this car right now, we're getting fingerprints on it. But we're going to continue on with our magnet test. So you got yourself a magnet there. There. Door. Cool little thing about this is uh, this Chrysler emblems here. Uh, essentially, when you would parallel park back in the day, they wanted you to see the Chrysler emblem whenever someone would walk by. And the last spot of the car. Sticking as it should because it's a solid southern car. Uh, cars has Kragers on all four corners with wider tires in the rear. Uh, the rear end is a Dana 60 with 355 gears and it does have posi traction, so that means both the wheels do spin. Um, if you have any questions about this car, please don't hesitate to give us a call. 954-363-2261. Enjoy this idol.